I do. I do. Then she joins the middle school mock trial team, her seventh grade year, and she meets Zach. And she comes home and she talks about this cute little boy with brown hair and brown eyes, and he's just so cute. And he wears the suit and he's just so, so it was great. So fast forward, <laughs> Emily goes to Clemson, and she tells me one day, you're not gonna believe who reached out to me. He's thinking of going to Clemson for grad school. Zach. Kurt, that kid that I used to be boyfriend girlfriend with in middle school and I was like <laughs> okay so before long she's talking about him all the time and if I know my baby girl she's falling she's falling hard they're good to each other they accept each other and support each other they respect each other and they love each other it's no coincidence that Zach came back in Emily's life because I know this is where God wants them to be. And we love you guys. We love you with all our heart, and we're very proud of both of you. The three wishes I had for Emily when she was born were that she was pretty, healthy, and had someone to love and protect her when she got older. Well, I'm three for three. My little baby is all grown up now and is starting her own family. My Little Princess is a combination of her mother's beauty, her sister's sass, her uncle's sarcasm, her papa's smile, and the loving, kind heart of her grandma. Oh, hell. <laughs> hey. Hey, hey. Oh, uh. uh. You look so handsome. Gary, do you give Emily away to Zach on this day? Yes, sir. Do you take Emily to be your lawfully wedded wife from this day forward? Whether times are good or bad, rich or poor, healthy or sick, will you love, honor, and cherish her as long as you both shall live? I do. Do you take Zach to be your lawfully wedded husband from this day forward. Whether times are good, <laughs> it's okay. You can say it twice, that's okay. Whether times are good or bad, rich or poor, healthy or sick, will you love, honor, and cherish him as long as you both shall live? In commitment to one another in the sight of these witnesses, it is my pleasure by the power vested in me by God and by the state of Georgia to now pronounce you husband and wife. Zach, you may kiss your bride. today both of your lives will change instead of being two you will become one and be your own family things one of you go through the both of you go through it will not be easy but you will lean on each other and lift one another up when the other is down and I'm so excited to see you both grow on this next chapter welcome to the family Zach and good luck I love you both <laughs> Keep 
loving each other. Keep holding on in those times where you just want to slap someone, walk out of the house, pack your bag, and never come back. Think about this moment right now. Because it can last if you make it last. Yeah. And you're both the most annoying and strong, <laughs> determined people I know. Oh my God, if anyone can do it, you can. You just have to put in the effort. I love you. Thank you. Sorry. Yeah.